the sharks get it. Good morning and happy Sunday everyone. We are making our way to our fish trap. Yeah, but the tide is just a little bit too high for the fish trap to be working at the moment. So we're gonna put a mask and snorkel on, go for a swim and then head down and try to catch something yeah, in the trap. Yeah, come along for the ride. Yeah, it's gonna be good guys. The water looks clear. Let's get straight in there. so long to get ready. It's only quite shallow where we're going so we can actually see the the bombies and the reef that we're gonna go check out so hopefully uh, hopefully there's a lot of fish life out there. What are you hoping to see Fran? It's a bit cold. <laughs> it's a bit cold eh? Yeah the season has definitely changed there's so many storms brewing in the horizon. Yeah there is. We're out snorkeling a new area and in order to like explore it fully Fran and I are actually gonna split up so She's swimming off down that way and I'm going to continue along here. What we're looking for is any bommies or patches of reef that might hold either crayfish or some tasty fish. Fingers crossed we can find something cool. Oh, that's a school of unicorn fish, which is a really good sign because even at low tide, we can target the unicorn fish. They like staying up on the reef flat here. Hey guys, that's a gut fish that's actually quite big for his species and it's delicious. These bombies here with a bit of a cave under it are really, really good. They will hold crayfish and other types of fish. So this is what we're looking for. There's a couple of big spider conch here. Look how well they're camouflaged. These guys are actually pretty tasty. We've eaten them before. Oh, damn. Oh, damn. I've just found a spot with heaps of fish life here. This is awesome. Let me go see how Fran's doing. Oh, this spot is so nice. How did you go? Yeah, that was awesome. We found some spots that are, are well worth coming back when we want to take a feed. But yeah, let's let's go for drop off, friend. Yeah. That was a set. Let's quickly go now. We notice the dolphins acting a bit strange and gathering around on the bottom. They're playing with the puffer fish, causing it to inflate in self-defense. The dolphins seem to be in a bit of a mischievous mood and as their focus shifts to chasing a shark, the tilefish take their chance and duck for cover in the sand. And the puffer fish deflates and takes his chance to make an escape. Nearby, a green turtle watches the show unfold. It's a 
upside down. She's thinking of the... Are you sure? Yeah. Are you going to try get her? I don't know. What do you think? Oh, you heard it. I reckon it'll be great. This is an epic battle, Fran's got the tail out the back, but she can't quite pull it out. I don't think it can fit out that back hole, so uh, she might have to come out through the front. The crayfish won that battle, it just slipped through Fran's hand and disappeared up the back of the cave. We'll have to keep looking. Got a little slipper cray. I could just feel him up there. Yeah, it's so cute. It's so cool when you, you just feel him up there without even seeing him. Ooh. He's only a little one though. Yeah, Put him back. Fred's gonna try and have a feel, see if there's a bigger one. I know. So what's the plan B? We go check the fish trap? Yeah, check the fish trap, see if we can catch anything there. Sounds good. <laughs> Look out, fish! Ready. Fran is ready. <laughs> Alright, so we're just coming up the beach here to where our fish trap is. Uh, and this is going to be our best chance to spear something. The last couple of times we've come here, We've got kind of very lucky with some, some fluky shots with a spear. Um, and we've got a unicorn fish and a, a really big bone fish. So let's see what we can get this time. There's a moray eel up hunting here. Check him out. There's not too much meat on them when, when they're that size. There's a lot of bones. <laughs> no, not that one. What do you see? I don't see something there. Yeah? I don't know, it's a tail out of the water. Let's go. Oh, check. yeah, 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 yeah. Friend, they're the unicorn fish. These are those unicorn fish we've got previously, and this could really be one of our best options here. They're actually coming close here. Alright, get ready. Oh, they're starting to spook, friend. They're starting to spook. That's the bow one. They're gone. They're gone. They're gone. Bugger, that school of unicorn fish is just spooked, but we'll keep moving on and see what else we can see. So guys, this is actually the area here where we hand caught a shark one day. So of course that is an option. If we can't find any fish, shark could be on the menu later. Yeah, give it a go or not? That was a shark, eh? Yeah, should I give it a go or not? We'll see if we can get a fish first and then shark as a last resort, eh, friend? Okay. So this here is our fish trap we're coming up to. Does it look like there's anything in there, friend? No, the tide is not quite right yet. Yeah. We'll just have a good look here, friend. This is where we sometimes see the unicorn tails and stuff from the parrotfish. Ooh. All right, now the tide's dropping. You can start to see the fish trap that Fran and I built. So basically, all this water drops out here. There's some sharks in here that are using it to hunt just like we are. The idea is that there's some fish that get caught in here and we'll be able to spear them before they make their way over the, over the wall. That's the plan. We'll see how we go. Oh, there's a big something. There are a few fish in here, Fran. Have you seen anything, Fran? Shark? Shark, yeah. Oh. The shark. It's been a bit harder to spot the fish this time, but there was a, a nice school of parrot fish and some really nice sweet lip that spooked out. I think we might have missed out with this run, guys. Oh, almost shark for dinner. Just missed him, I think. 
There's a few sharks that have come in here. And Fran's getting closer and closer with every shot. <laughs> oh! That was close. Alright, tide is not quite right, so we're gonna try and catch something on the headline. Pretty. Alright, let's see if I can catch something on the hand line. We gotta find some bait. These nails are actually really good bait. I can see a bonefish going for it, smelling around. I'm getting some bites. Come on. I'm on! <laughs> Yay! I'm on! Woo! Spit it off. Far out. That's like my finger here. I don't know if you can see it. That was so strong. It was a bonefish. Look what I just found. Is a hermit crab without a shell. They look so funny without a shell. I'm gonna go look for one and bring it to him. There you go. I just found a better shell for him. He didn't like that one. Get it? It's a perfect shell for you. We got reinforcement. It's getting a little bit late in the day, so we're getting desperate, but whatever we catch is probably gonna be dinner now. just got caught out by the rain. Oh, there's a turtle there. Yeah, there's a, I think it's actually mating. There's a turtle here that is looks like it's elevated on top of another turtle. I think that's how turtles get it on. So we'll keep an eye on it. Hopefully we can capture it on footage. <laughs> but there's a, there's a heap of rain around. So we're just kind of working around that. Once this rain cloud passes, we're gonna try and catch something on the hand line. What do you think it is that it's fighting? Oh, it must be just little because he's just having a bite. Oh. Oh. Yes. Got one. Woohoo! Got one. What Ooh. is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? What is it? <laughs> We've got something. It's a little silver? Oh. What is it? It's a. A bone fish! <laughs> that is awesome. Look at that. Yay! Only a fairly little one, but he's a lively little bonefish. That is great. There's a shark over there. Go, oh, little man. Just let him catch his breath. Oh, shark coming. Uh, Whoa, three of them. Don't let it go now. Sharks are onto it. Go away. Let's run down the beach. Go away. Let's go down here. Yay! Run, 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 run! Good job! Good release. Your turn, friend. Nice one. Just trying to catch something else for dinner. Oh, you're backing up the beach. Ah! Holy moly! You got one? Yep. Oh, geez, it's fast. Quick, friend. Ah! Oh, look at it going. Quick before the sharks get it. Go, 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 go! Go scare the shark! Oh, this one looks big! Pull it up, pull it up, pull it up! Holy moly! Whoa! Well done, Fred! That is a beauty! Yay. That one's big enough for dinner for us. This headline is so painful! Well done! Alright, there's a storm coming at the vector, so we're gonna have this guy for dinner. You know the drill, get the fire going, put it on. Yeah, that's right guys, you, you've seen it all before, so we're gonna uh, love you and leave you here. Bonefish for dinner, we'll see you next Sunday guys. Thanks for tuning in guys! <laughs> <laughs>